Hey guys, and welcome to episode 3 of my spring break series. Today is another day in Frankfurt, so in this video I'm going to be covering our last day in Frankfurt as well as our flight from Frankfurt to Rome. Although our hotel offered breakfast, we decided that it would be a fun adventure to walk out for breakfast on our last day here. So we went to this super cute place called Sunnyside Up and they had an amazing breakfast variety. I got these super delicious eggs, my dad got a bagel, and my brother of course got pancakes. After breakfast, we found ourselves wandering around quite a bit. Um, my mom found a Chanel, and Chanel is one of her favorite brands, so of course she had to go in and check it out. Then we saw a bunch of police cars, and we found out that there was a protest going on for Ukraine, so we decided to head over and participate. That was definitely one of the most important and most impactful parts of this trip and I'm going to have a link in the description to places you can donate to the Ukraine and help support them as well as some educational resources so you can learn about what's going on. As you can see here, we definitely did a little bit of damage on the shopping spectrum, but I was super happy with my purchases, so it's okay. This is another thing that I wanted to comment on real quickly. There was a super cool air show demonstration going on in support of the Ukraine that was saying peace in three different languages as well as stop the war. After our walk, it was time for a quick lunch. Actually, most of the lunch places were closed. We had quite a late lunch, but this nice Indian man let us come in and eat even though they were closed. Is that good? Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you. I speak Deutsch. My mother did not. Why is that? Yeah. Why did Ah, uh, ich habe im, im Frankfurt gewohnt seit letzte August und sie sind von den USA. Ah, okay. ja. Sie studieren hier oder studieren oder nur? Ich habe gestudiert, aber nicht mehr. Ah, nicht mehr. What museum are we going to right now? A uh, science, uh, like a science museum. So as you will see here in a few minutes, the whole reason that we walked all the way down this way was to go to this science museum and it was actually closed. Um, so I was extremely frustrated. I actually had a mental breakdown on the way back. I was crying. We had to figure out where to go on the train to get back home. It was a mess. So although that was quite disappointing, we headed back to the hotel and pulled ourselves together I got cleaned up and then we decided that it was time to do something else. So we freshened up and we headed out to the mine tower and there we were able to watch the sunset which was super nice and a great way to make up for that little event earlier.
So as you can clearly see, this definitely made up for our detour previously. The view from up here is absolutely incredible, cannot be beat. I've been up here before, but it was super fun to share this experience with my family. Um, and I got some pictures up here, so if you want to go check those out on my Instagram, the link is in my description and my at will be right up here on the screen. Before we knew it, it was dinner time and so we went up into this tour room here. They have a restaurant built in and it was exquisite. Like let me tell you, it was so cool in there. The menu was amazing and we also found the bathrooms were up in the top of the tower, which was so cool. My mom found it fascinating so we just wandered around there for a little bit. So for dinner, we did a more family style meal where we got a bunch of stuff and just shared. Um, so we got Flammkuchen, which is kind of a traditional German pizza sort of thing. And then we also got this hot stone where we were able to cook our own meat, which was super fun. After that lovely end to the night before, it was a bright and early morning for us on the next day and this was the day that we left Frankfurt to fly to Rome. We dropped off all the baggage that we didn't need at the Hilton Hotel right there with the airport. It's super cool, it's connected and so convenient. Um, and then we took the bags that we did need and got ready to get on our flight. Here we are in the Rome airport. We finally arrived. This was one of my favorite parts of the trip, but I hate to do this, you guys, but I'm going to cut this video short. So stay tuned for the next episode in this spring break series to keep up with our Rome adventures. This was one of my favorite parts, and I know you guys are going to love it. So I will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on my socials, and I'll see you in the next one. Tschüss!